Hi, so I've got this old circuit board from an old Technics uh, tape player. Really handy components on here. I've already stripped some off already, but I was desoldering it last night. It was taking a long time to desolder. Wasn't really um, doing, getting much uh, progress. I want to show you in really quick, easy way of removing anything off a circuit board to use it for future use and to reuse the circuit board afterwards. Simple as this. All you need is one of these, a Dremel. Find what you want to take off. Let's take off these ones here, all these little components. So I've just rubbed it all down, all the solder off. Not damaging the actual uh, uh, little kind of diodes and transistors at all through heat from the uh, solder nine. Just taken off all the solder. <laughs> Once you've rubbed all that off the back, you can just quite simply either pull it off very carefully. I've got a hole capacitor there undamaged I've got a transistor here comes off really easily I've got more components just coming right off easy peasy pickings another transistor you can remove anything you like let's try this I see circuit here. Okay, so we've got all the back of the IC or the solder off and get our screwdriver. And we should be able to just lift that up, as you can see, come straight off. No damage to the IC. A couple of legs need bending back into place, but that's about it. That IC took me seconds to get off. In perfect order. Can be reused again. And the beautiful thing about this is that once you've done all this, you can actually rub this, all this copper off, all the back of it off. You've got holes already in it, pre-drilled. You can make your own circuits up. Just put your own circuit on the back here with some copper tape, you're done.